Pan in Motion took you on a journey to Morocco in the last episode and gave you the inside look on the experience. We covered the first three days, which included two rehearsals in a nearby studio, a tour of the city of Rabat, which is where we stayed, and an impromptu performance in a Juve street processional. This episode, we will give you a more in-depth discussion featuring myself and my colleagues, Wayne Bernard, Odie Franklin, and Jelani Roberts. Hope you enjoy. You are now watching Pan in Motion TV. So on November 19th, I had the pleasure of going to Morocco uh, with these fellas, my friends, my colleagues. Um, we took the instrument of Steel Pan to Morocco along with something positive and power mass. We represented Brooklyn Steel Orchestra and we were part of a production called Juve Fest. Uh, I thought that it would be really interesting and really great to hear their views on, on their experience in Morocco um, and see what they liked about it and what they got, got out of it. I know for me personally, um, it was a, a very different experience um, seeing the, somebody else's culture and experiencing that. And, um, and I don't know, what you thought, Odi? I think the culture was more like um, reserved because like, I, I have one moment when we passed a bar and they was actually watching like sports. They was watching football or soccer, American soccer, whatever the case is. And everybody's sitting in the same direction, sipping tea, not one noise. And yeah. that, really, that really got to me. So it was like, if it was America, it would have been a different story. You know, we've been yeah, drinking and so noise, here. Yeah. Ah, a lot of cheering, whatever the case is, and everybody's sitting just like quiet and preserved. Yeah. I'll never forget that. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. I yeah, remember I do remember that. that. I actually remember we also went to the liquor store out there, which, you know, there's not many of. It's not promoted like it is out here. It's just, um, you almost got to find it. You know, you got to stumble across it. And we went inside of one and there was a drunk man that had come in the store to buy something and the owners just forced them out. They were like, nope, we're not even going to deal with it. Just leave one time. They didn't entertain it. They didn't take his money. And out here, you know, we kind of enable that lifestyle. Yeah, do, so definitely. it doesn't matter if you're a drinker, if the owners know you're drunk, if they know you're drunk at the moment, if you have the money to pay for it, they'll sell it to you. But out there, they're more about the people than yeah. everything else. Yeah. 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 What, about, else. what about the, um, the, the, how do you guys feel about the, the rehearsal and the performing aspect out there? Like I know <clears throat> all of us were used to performing, like whether we do personal gigs or we perform on a big stage for Panorama, or we perform in professional concerts and stuff like that. And um, yeah, just, I mean, what do you guys think about our performance or what we did or what we were about to bring to the table out there. I definitely feel like that. I feel like our performance was definitely something to remember. Uh, I really appreciate it. It made me appreciate how the people really took to the, the, the whole concept and the whole vibe that we really brought out yeah. there. Um, the African German infusion with the with the dancing and, and the steel pan it was definitely some, something to remember. And then the after effects, like I remember how we went to the restaurant and, those guys ran us down and made us really feel like we were big celebrities. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, shout out to my boys out in Morocco. <laughs> shout out to y'all, yeah. man. I yeah. mean, that was definitely something that was like an awe moment for me. I was just yeah. like, wow. Yeah, like, that was probably. I never good. had something like that before, you know, happen. It was yeah. really, that was really nice. Yeah. Uh, and I feel like they really appreciated like the, the steel pan instrument itself. Right, yeah. It's different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was yeah. definitely different. From yeah, they don't have a lot of exposure with that. Um, I've made a point to somebody out here, I was telling them it's important for more of us to go out there because when you're walking around Morocco or Mar Rabat where we were, you don't really see a lot of people that look like us or that look different from each other. Everybody sort of has, they're the same skin complexion, they speak the same two languages, which are Arabic and French. They um, have the same dialects and everything about them is the same, they're just used to each other, whereas yeah. they don't see a lot of people, especially not black American that come yeah. out there, they see a lot of more people from like Senegal, Ethiopia, Nigeria, mm -hmm. but they're not going to see a lot of black Americans, so it's important that we show them what our culture is and they respect it. I, I felt like we did that too, because mm -hmm. uh, the whole um, Juve Fest, mm -hmm. where we did the, uh, the street portion of it, the parade, and I remember when we were first going, I was like, who's really going to Follow us, yeah, yeah, yeah. like, mm -hmm. we're gonna be parading through the streets, kind of looking stupid. And right. it's like when we really started, 
And I turned around, I was like, wow. Yeah. Like, everybody's really parading along with us. Kids. Yeah. It was, it was, that was, that was It was awesome. into the masqueraders, too. Yeah, yeah they, was, they, were, they were very into it. Yeah. 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 They took yeah. so much yeah. pictures. Yeah. 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 Oh, and there's a drum line out there. We saw the drum line yeah. out there. Everywhere it was a participate with, right? Yeah. yeah, they came on the truck. Yeah, that was a nice. Yeah, that was that was good. I kind of got caught up in that moment too. I, like I took a couple it's, pictures. It's different. Yeah, because when you see it, like I, I don't know. It, I mean, I, I think it's like Wayne said. I didn't expect that so many people would have been there, like for mm -hmm. the actual Juve to watch us like that. Yeah. When we hear we Juve, it's like all right, Juve is normal for us. We in Juve in Brooklyn, it's normal. <laughs> it's normal. But yeah, but out there, I really didn't expect that. I didn't expect all them people. Wow. People music, to be out there. Music is universal too. It's just you know we didn't even have to communicate with each other. We just express through. Just, yeah, just music yeah. language. Kind of, you know, kind of seen that with Jelani when he yeah, was playing up, same thing. upstairs. Yeah, and yeah. Like, I started going with the uh, with, with the little bundle. Right. Yeah. 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 Wow. yeah. I was gonna say that like a lot of the time um, we would speak in two different languages and we were able to communicate through other things. So like you said, how they they came out to us and they just bigged us up. They gave us love. We were sitting at a dinner table in a the restaurant. They made us leave, yeah, go outside, outside, stand up in the street yeah. and take pictures. Take pictures with them, yeah. They were real hospitable everywhere we went. Mm -hmm. And it had nothing to do with they thought we were somebody famous. Like they yeah. knew yeah. who we were. Well, they didn't know who we were. They knew we were just regular people, but they respected our name. Yeah. Well, I mean, our, our game. Our name. Yeah, yeah. Well, we did, yeah. Being out there, it made me, and seeing how they take to the whole culture and the pan, it just really made me appreciate pan so much more coming back home. Yeah. You know, hearing <laughs> another moment for me was, you know, um, looking when I was looking for you guys or whatever, I think we had to split up for a moment, then I heard pan, but it wasn't <laughs> any of us. <laughs> it wasn't yeah. any of us. It's me, the pan man, all the way in Morocco. Yeah, big up the bubbles. Yeah, bubbles. Yeah. Bubbles, 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 I was, um, when you guys came, he was like, you hear Pan. I was like, what the hell, what, what are you guys yeah, talking about? Yeah, I had to yeah, look yeah, through five, we looked through five floors for that. For the, for the Pan, right? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Found the song, the song, the song. Yeah, and, and I definitely thought it was one of us before, before we got upstairs. No, I knew it wasn't. That's kind of interesting to think that we're the only people in the whole country for one instrument. Like, exactly. that's right. different, that's yeah. a different kind of a feeling right there. I forgot how big that felt. Yeah. Yeah, that was crazy. I was going all the way around the world and then and meet somebody. Yeah, meet somebody yeah. playing pen. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's yeah, also good nice. to, to see other groups from around the world. Oh my yeah. God. Yeah. Perform and, and, yeah. and yeah. Yeah. showcase kind of themselves. Yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. Muse, the, the musicality, the, the level of musicianship these guys have, yeah. that Martinique band, uh, if y'all yeah. ever watched this video <laughs> somehow, I'm, I'm, the biggest fan. I'm the biggest bad. fan. I'm the biggest fan. It bad. was amazing just to get some us. Good drummers, some good singers. Some... I got some great video that I just listened to in rotation. Like yeah. their rhythms are really different, and then you can even see how, like, where our music derives from. Because again, we are in Africa. That's where everything started. Yeah. So it's really interesting to see like how we've taken certain things that they consider traditional and morphed it into like one of the bands are playing something that I identify as like hip hop or trap, mm -hmm. but it was not. Right, right. You know, and to me it's just like, well you can kinda see how it developed over time into what it is. Right. It was yeah. really cool to get the right. you know the yeah. source. Hey guys, I hope you liked our discussion on our trip to Morocco. We really enjoyed sharing our experiences with you. Now before we wrap things up, take a look at some additional footage. And as always, Pan in Motion thanks you for watching. Enjoy. Sound check is over with. Me yeah. and the bro. Sound check, was a Sound check is over with. And now I decided that I'd like to show you guys the walk from the venue back to our hotel. Visa for music is the name of the venue, or at least the name of the company. It was, yeah, that's the name of the festival, yeah. These are for music. Yeah,
This is uh, Thanksgiving night. Uh, actually, it's Friday here in Morocco, but Thanksgiving night for most of you back in Brooklyn. Um, this is Kendall K. Williams of Pan in Motion. Just took a nice 10, 12 minute walk from the hotel down to a boat where there's entertainment for the views, uh, Visa for Music. Um, just want to show you guys a sort of beautiful view behind me. It was a very nice walk. Maybe we'll make that trip on the back just so you guys get an idea of what we're getting, getting out here. It's all of this is very nice and calm in the night. There's water behind me. Across there, there's boats that carry you over on that side. So the view is real nice out here. Ah, the boat that we're going to is right there where all those lights are. Hope you can see it. We'll be on a boat in a few to check out this entertainment. But definitely beautiful. Wish most of you guys were out here to, to experience this. This is a big part of what dedicating your life to Pan is all about. And there's a lot of you out there that wants to do it. And I hope that you all get the opportunity the way that I was um, given this opportunity or chosen for this opportunity, rather. I also hope that I can help help more people get the same opportunities that I have, if not more. Um, just sharing is, is, is a big part of what it's all about. Sharing the wealth, sharing the knowledge, and getting everybody to, um, to get these same opportunities. All right, let's keep pushing forward, people. Keep moving forward. Let's go. Pan in motion. We out. Pan in motion. Thank you so much.